Love and exclusive possession can never go together. Theoretically, where there is perfect love, there is perfect non-possession. Gandhi, October 1935. This is a very hard-hitting, very trenchant uh, observation of Gandhi's because if you go and watch a movie on television or internet or whatever, what you'll find is that love goes pretty much together with absolute possession. <laughs> what he's saying is that when there's that kind of possession, really a serious mistake, a spiritual mistake, of convincing yourself that you can and should possess another human being, it really pushes love out the window. And I'm reminded of our teacher, Eknath Ishwin, when he was uh, about 16, getting ready to go out in the world. His grandmother and his mother, who just absolutely had doted on him, they didn't say, you know, come home soon or anything like that. They said, you go out and follow your own star and show the world what kind of a boy we have raised. So that for me is very moving and very challenging. To love is to want the welfare of the other person, and that welfare may and should include their personal freedom. Mm -hmm.